took a shower this morning. Oh, and I didn't have time to blow dry it all the way, so it's like half wet, half straight. I don't know what it is, but I just didn't want to wait around anymore. <sighs> Good morning. Hello. I'm starting Vlogmas a little bit late today, because <clears throat> like I said, <laughs> I it was one of those mornings where you just needed to like groom. I had to like, you know, do my mustache, tweeze my eyebrows, wash my hair, all that stuff. So, it's 11 o'clock now. I am in the car I need to go out and pick up my grandma's birthday cake tomorrow's her 80th birthday and we're gonna all go over there just for lunch bring her her presents hang out for a little bit bring her a cake I've been trying to find like a good cake spot around here but it's been a little tricky so I'm gonna go to this one place and kind of just see what they have I also need to pick up um, white wine for my holiday sangria I'm sure you guys are so sick of me talking about the holiday party on Christmas Eve it's just like such a big day and I'm so excited about it um, yeah, sorry my hair is not like super cute. You can see it's all like wet underneath. You know how you just don't have the patience some days? I just didn't have the patience. I'm like, well, let it air dry and I'll curl it later. But anyway, I wanted to do something a little, little different for you guys today just to give you some sort of different content here. I'm going to do, oh, oh God, a neighbor. One of my neighbors is here. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. He's staring at me. Oh no. Anyway, I thought I would do a what's in my purse video today, <laughs> but um, just to like switch up the content a little bit. I'm sorry, I'm so awkward. You know, let me, let me come back in a second. Okay, <laughs> I'm alone now. So let's do a what is in my Louis Vuitton um, Poche Matisse, Pochette Matisse. I don't know how to pronounce it properly. Please don't judge me. But anyway, you guys have been complimenting this bag so much. This was my birthday gift to myself. I was like very excited. I was, I've been wanting a real Louis Vuitton forever. Um, I had a fake one a long time ago. You can judge me when I was a child, but like I always just wanted a real one and it was just such a magical thing to buy. Like I literally wanted to cry when I got, when I got it. So I just love this bag so much. I feel like she's the perfect size. Um, I just, I can fit everything in here. It's nice and neutral so it matches everything. I use it every single day. Um, and they're sold out like absolutely everywhere. Um, I think there's like a few months of a wait list. So I went online and I got mine from TradeZ.com. It was a little more expensive than they are at the store just because they know they're in high demand. But um, they have like, they go through like a system and it's all like authentic. Like it was literally a new bag. I think probably someone bought a few and like knew that they would be popping and then could upsell a bed and make some profit. But you know what? <laughs> I'm the idiot that fell for it, but I love my purse. So anyway, let's go in here. So the bag's pretty pretty cute pretty perfect size it has the strap up here and a crossbody strap so to open it you have to just pinch these two together and it opens and then you just push it in to close it so I really like that feature and there is a zipper on the back where I usually put my phone so inside there are two openings separating it which I really like I have like a section for like my keys I have a section for my wallet and um, I kind of just keep it really organized and there's like a little secret flap in the back where I keep all my feminine products <laughs> So in the back here, besides my feminine products, I also have this little nail kit from BoxyCharm, um, NCLA Los Angeles Nailed It kit. So I love having this, this is convenient, because you know what, when you're out and you, you know, break a nail or like something chips, like I can't stop touching it. So I, I hate when there's like a dent in my nail or like a chip or something, because I can't stop like touching it. So I have like a file in here, nail clippers, little scissors. So it's just like super convenient to have in case you need it. So in the middle flap here, just this middle one, this is where I keep my wallet. I got this from ThreadUp and I use it every single day in my bag. It's from Moschino um, and it was on ThreadUp for like some crazy good price. Like I work with ThreadUp regularly but I also like love to shop on it because I really like the system. I also have my Fit Me Maybelline powder in the color 130. I always need a touch up powder because your girl is oily. I have some Tylenol. I have this super cute pen from Target. I can't remember the brand, but they had those really cool pens this year, so I've, I've kept that pen forever. I have to have a Tied to Go stick. I have to have it, because if you know me at all, I spill every other day something new on my body. Um, I have a couple lip products. Uh, let's see. I have the KKW Beauty Iridescent Lip Gloss. It's yeah, iridescent. It looks kind of holographic. I have my Grande Lips Hydrating Lip 
plumper in I think bare at all I think I wear this nude plumping gloss almost every day and then when I'm wearing matte I wear the Mac velvet teddy I have my little um, I believe this was Marc Jacobs decadent I think Ugh, could be wrong but it's a Marc Jacobs perfume and it's like such a good good smell and you only need a little bit and it's strong it stays on all day Blistex eye drops if you have contacts I get the Visine for contacts lubricating and re-wetting drops if your eyes get a little bit dry and a little mascara from Duche that comes in a boxy charm so that's all that's in the middle pouch like you'd be surprised this bag can really fit a decent amount but it doesn't feel like a lot and then the last little front flap here I have some peppermint candy cane gum I love candy cane gum it's like minty but it's kind of sweet um, oh it's all gone I had some breath savers throw that away oops oh no I have my stress relief Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer which I use all the time because I'm not trying to get sick again I still have a little bit of this cold the cough's pretty much gone but little runny nose a little phlegmy um, I have my keys and I also oh I forgot to put this away when I wear this red lip I keep it in my bag to touch up if I need to throughout the day this is the Fenty Beauty um, this is so I didn't know this thank God someone told me this is the Stunna lip paint I thought the color was called Stunna but that's just the name of the lip paints the color is called uncensored so thank you guys for pointing that out to me because I have just been babbling like an idiot not knowing so that's all it's in my bag I love this purse it's definitely a good purchase um, and it's definitely my favorite bag so anywho wanted to just do something a little special for you guys and I've been getting a lot of questions about that bag um, so anyway I love the bag so we're gonna head to um, I'm trying to think where my best option is I think maybe I can go to Wegmans because I can get the wine the cake and the groceries that I need I haven't been to Wegmans in forever maybe we'll go to Wegmans I can check out their bakery section too and then if the bakery's not good I can go to the bakery I had in mind yes that's it guys I am leaving <laughs> I got into the Wegmans Plaza. It's insane. I know it's Friday and it's gonna be crazy everywhere, but like I'm not doing this. I will go somewhere else. I, there's no parking. Like in this giant massive lot, there's nothing. I don't even know. This is terrifying. Oh my God. It's gonna be like this everywhere, but this, this is too much. Guys, I just got to my backup spot. The back parking lot where no one has ever parked is full and I'm parked semi-illegally I'm not really sure it looks like a parking spot I'm gonna run shit okay I'm back by the grace of God I got her cake I can't see it I'll show you when we get home Whew, it's crazy <laughs> I can't even imagine tomorrow the day before Christmas Eve okay I'm gonna you know liquor store is gonna be crazy too I need wine for my Christmas drink sorry I've only showed myself in the car not in these stores but you don't want to see it's chaos I got everything I needed the wine the little bit of groceries I had left that my grandma needed me to pick up for tomorrow her cake so success took a few hours <laughs> a few locations but we did it god bless there's a man staring at me and he's <sighs> creeping me out I'm finally home that was a journey I was out for a solid two and a half hours and that would normally take like maybe 45 minutes wild <laughs> when you're watching this tomorrow if y'all have to go out to the grocery store god bless <laughs> good luck guys so i got i have my little setup here as you guys know for the party so this is my favorite one and only favorite wine barefoot moscato i love it is so sweet and delish <laughs> it's honestly the only wine that i like though so if you're looking for a wine that's a little bit more sweet and you're not a fan of like dry bitter wine definitely give this a try it's so good so we have our sparkling cider our wine i have um, crackers for the cheese board and i am so excited for christmas and my birthday when you're watching this my birthday is tomorrow all right guys i am hanging out in my office now i've cleaned a little bit <sighs> After we curl my hair, after we curl my hair, because we're in this together, I thought I would just sit down. I'm taking a little break, curling my hair, um, and then I'm going to go and clean the bathroom. So, we'll, we'll hang out while I clean the bathroom. So, anywho, I'm going to go ahead and curl my hair. Guys, literally, this hair oil 
even with the extensions when I let my hair extensions kind of air dry or even when I blow them with a, um, a hair dryer until I curl them they usually look wicked frizzy like <laughs> like like it usually looks like like straw like I don't even know how to describe it any better than that but when I use this oil my hair is so much softer this is not sponsored I bought this at Urban Outfitters and um, Alexandria Garza uses it so I thought I'd give it a whirl this stuff is bomb it's the way hair oil oh oh you ai way um this stuff is amazing you don't need a lot of it but put it on your damp hair after the shower use a little bit um from like here down you can use a little on dry hair too my hair has never been softer like never like it's so smooth it's usually such a mess trust me all right let me curl my hair okay hair is curled um i haven't brushed them out yet i'm just letting them kind of cool down and set for a minute but I just got a big package. This is for my grandfather's Christmas gift. So the other day on Twitter, I asked for, um, I needed help with graphic design. My grandpa wrote like a short story slash book this year and I wanted to make him something special for it. So he said he pictured it as a lifetime movie. We all did, cause we all read it, I loved it. So I had a graphic designer make a movie poster for it and it came out so good, let me, give her a twitter shout out because she is amazing um her twitter name is at underscore sid marie s-i-d marie so she did an amazing job thank you so much if you're watching so i ordered him a frame for it and i'm gonna put it in the frame and i'll show you guys how it came out it's so good Okay, so that was actually quite difficult to maneuver, but it's in, yay! Doesn't it look so good? She did such a good job, it looks like a real movie poster. So it's about this couple, and like, Tony's Bakery, and there's a snow globe for their love. It's like real, it's a really good little thing. I love it. But I think this will really get him excited. It's so big, like look how huge it is. It's like a real movie poster. And it's snowing! Can you guys see the snow? so cozy it looks like a snow globe the snow globe get it the snow globe 20 minutes later that was fun to wrap the snow got chunky i love when it's chunky it's so thick she's so thick update i just cleaned the bathroom and my god i did not want to bring you in there men are gross when Never mind. You're picking up what I'm putting down. Anyway, brought my vacuum out. I'm gonna vacuum soon. I don't know why I decided to update my computer now. Do you guys like ever? I have had that update thing popping up for like weeks, maybe like months. And I just kept saying, remind me tomorrow, remind me tomorrow. And like my computer is starting to run a little slower and I'm like, fine, I'll update it. But I thought it was gonna be quick and I have something I need to do on the computer. So now I'm just waiting for it, watching some Vlogmas. Um, I'll tell you guys who I watch for Vlogmas, like, consistently every day. I love that Trisha Paytas was on board with it this year. She's vlogging, like, every day pretty much. So I watch her, Alex and Michael. I watch Alex's sister, Frankie, and I really like her channel. I've been watching it, um, Francesca Garza. She has, like, really good content. And her puppy is really cute. Who else? Who else? Oh my gosh. Oh, I also watch, um, her other friend, Mallory. <laughs> like love all those people um, I feel like I watched someone else this is stressing me out I had some oh I watched Shannon Rose I watch her vlogmas videos sometimes not like super consistently but sometimes I'm gonna go through my watch list um, I've been like binging 73 questions with from Vogue like I've watched so many I don't know what happened I fell in a hole sometimes I watch Remy um, I watch Julian Jenna Marbles, Ryland, Chris Clemens, Kelly, of course, Shane. That's pretty much like my go-to group. So, anyway, let me show you how clean my bathroom is. Sorry this vlog's a little boring, it's super chill. That's why I wanted to do something special in the beginning, the what's in my purse, because I'm like, I gotta give you guys some good content. I'm wearing my Levi shirt. That Amazon fashion haul, I literally am obsessed with those, like all the pieces. I've been wearing them every day. Okay, bathroom. 
clean bathroom tour. The floor has been swiffered. The toilet has been scrubbed from head to toe. This sink area has been shinily scrubbed. The mirrors have been Windexed. Oh yeah, they have. Um, and I think, I think that's all, but took a lot longer than it did to say it. <laughs> all right, while I'm waiting for my darn computer to finish <sighs> updating, let's vacuum my office. Okay, so I find this extremely fascinating. I was looking at um, the updates with the new software, and it says on Safari, browse without being tracked. Remember when you looked at that mountain bike and then saw mountain bike ads everywhere you browsed? Safari now removes cross-site tracking data, so it's more difficult for advertisers to follow you. That is fascinating because that is such a real thing. I thought it was directly linked to like Facebook. I feel like that's what I've heard anyway, but um, because that's like, such a real thing like I will google the most random things I'm so random and I will see ads for it like an hour later on like Facebook Instagram so wow fascinating all right I thought I would wrap up today's episode of vlogmas by my tree just because it's really pretty but anyway I hope you enjoyed the house is clean your girl is ready for her Christmas Eve party tomorrow I'm going to my grandma's like I said for her 80th birthday so you guys can come along and say happy birthday to her and yeah I love you guys so much thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow bye bye <laughs>